In this video, we do X modeling. Simple uh, extrude extrusion. How to use extrusion? Okay, this is the basic sketch. For example, I use a cylinder basic shape with some thing like this, and I use a subdivisions like this just basic idea getting the basic idea how to do that tax and in the bottom even I want some design like this this sketching is mainly gives the idea of how to proceed further when you are sketching when you are uh, sketching it gives idea it gives a uh, idea to do in 3d gives clarity in your mind how to do it something like that okay so for example I will start this uh, with a uh, cylinder basic primitive is uh, cylinder after that uh, I create uh, I use edges use uh, subdivisions for example uh, use uh, subdivisions then I extrude it out and I extrude it out like this and I select the vertices and I shape them like that that is how if you are this is for beginners this tutorial is for beginners so try to understand how to do this okay. jump into Maya this is our basic sketching for example uh, jump into Maya create polygon primitives cylinder primitive is our uh, primitive is cylinder just create uh, basic cylinder for example I don't want those many edges I want around 12 or 8 we'll start from 8 we'll see hold on 5 I want more height for example see so this is the uh, okay, we will start with uh, 10 yeah, we'll start with 10 edges move it up Even height we need few things like this I want to move them up I told you as I told you in the sketching part the, these are the faces we use for extrusion these are the faces we use for extrusion okay even we need three more here so I think later we can you we can use a insert edge loop tool that will be easy insert uh, edge loop tool insert edge loop tool that's what I do for example select the faces and extrude if you extrude in local mode it comes like this so try to do it in global mode it will come this way first getting the basic shape okay getting the basic shape if you want this to be small size try to you should uh, done this first something like this pull it up and scale it even back side you try to extrude them hold down control and select extrude it outside local mode extrude it something like this 
scale it up. I want to have a strength kind of thing. I want to increase this one. See, this is basic shape. Now you need to even top angle. Try to scale it. Use. Uh, I'm using. I'm clicking on R. That is the shortcut for uh, scaling manipulator. Just learning the tool, then insert edge loop tool. Just click on insert edge loop tool. I want three edges so that to get the proper shape. Even I want like this some edges so that I can give proper shape to it. Insert edge loop tool. Yes. Now go to side view. interview whatever you say select the vertices and move it so this is what really our concentration is extrusion extrude tool so just don't bother about uh, if you're not understanding if you're facing any problem just i want to show you how to use extrude tool how to use a extrude tool in this video hold on select like this hold on control and deselect these things now i want to extrude up extrude global mode scaling up yeah again g last user tool global mode scale it up Again, G. Last use the tool. Global mode. Just scale it down. Click on that. Scale it down. See, you got some bulginess. In the same way, he use it here. Hold down faces. Select all like this. Deselect. Hold down control and drag like this. Then extrude. Global mode. Uh, scale it this way. One more extrusion. Something like this. Again, uh, G. Last user tool. Extrude this way. Hold down G. Extrusion this way. Hold down G. Click on G. And why I kept these adjustments? I want to select those faces. Hold on control and deselect like this. Extrude them out. Okay. For example, you can use this uh, very creatively. That is what I want to tell you. See, hold on control, deselect. And again extrude out and uh, try to scale it down control Z global mode like this this is what is the axe basic axe see I used completely extrude tool to create this just started with the polygon primitive cylinder Polygon primitive cylinder, then I use the extrude tool to create it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel. You will have a lot of tutorials like this about all the tools of Maya. I'm going to explain in the next few months. So try to um, comment on the video, try to like the video, and try to subscribe to the channel. And uh, if you want more videos like this, try to ask in the comments. Okay. Thank you. Have a great day, great day guys. Thank you so much. Happy my learning.